7,000 miles away, in paradise. Intrepid scientists decided to try to answer that question. Hawaii's most famous volcano, Kilauea, erupted with a startling blast of gas and ash that forced the evacuation of 2,000 tourists and scientists. Despite the hostile environment, researchers decided it was time to test the noxious air of an erupting volcano at the source. Using sensitive instruments suspended from state-of-the-art balloons, scientists Adam Durant and Matt Watson managed to launch their equipment directly over the volcano's roiling crater. Even wearing protective gear, they could spend only a few minutes at the site. Any longer, and they risked exposure to potentially fatal concentrations of sulfur dioxide gas. Sorry, definitely up slightly now. The balloons were piloted remotely by satellite link using a flight trajectory visualization system that incorporated Google Earth. Yeah, yeah. They're all on top of the volcanic cloud. The team retrieved the balloon 40 miles from the launch point. I found it. Yeah. For the first time, scientists were able to directly measure the evolution of gases being produced by the volcano using a balloon-based system. They found that, even hours after emission, potentially hazardous concentrations of gases could be detected in nearby residential communities downwind from the volcano. But fortunately, the gases dissipate quickly as they move away from the source. Of the world's active volcanoes, Kilauea is a relatively gentle and predictable one. 